Hey there YouTube, France Hopper here. It's Saturday, March the 24th, and finally, after many delays, Nino Kuni 2 is finally here. Yes, really. It's not delayed for like the upteenth time. It's here. It's it's here. This is obviously the collector's edition, and uh, this time around they actually have them numbered, which is kind of cool. Um, back when the first one came out, I got the collector's edition for the PS3, uh, or I guess I should say a luck now, because apparently that was a royal disaster to order directly from Bondi. Uh, this time they got smart, and they had them on Amazon and GameStop and whatever, so I don't know if this is like 8,704 out of 2500 for Amazon or just in general, but uh, yeah, apparently I have uh, 8704 and uh, it's quite a large box. In fact, you know what, for comparison, if I can dig out the PS3 box here real quick, I'll show you just how much larger it is. So for comparison, this was the PS3 it's collector's edition. That's the PS4. Just a just a little bit bigger this time around. And I'm gonna set that aside and deal with putting that back on the shelf later because yeah, there's a obviously a lot to dig into this. So let's see. On the front, got some uh, you know nice Nino Kuni 2 artwork there. Uh, the bottom is pretty blank. Some more artwork on the side there. Here's the back with a blurb on the game and everything that's in here. There's quite a bit. I'm sure these two items probably take up a fair amount of space and definitely the additional art. I mean, that that's probably why this is so large. Um, yeah, let's see. All right, looks like we do have some little bits on the bottom to cut. So let me go grab some scissors. Usually I cheat and have this done ahead of time. This time I'm around, I wasn't thinking. So let's cut you two real quick. All right. And... Let's put it back down, and ta-da! It's uh, it's so stuffed full of stuff that stuff just can't wait to come out, and it just falls out. So we got our little plushy. Let's see, what is this? This is the drippy plush. Is that what this guy is? Lofty. It's lofty this time around. Never mind. So, we got the little plush. Um, obviously, you got a chibi diorama there. Let's see if we can take any of this stuff out like without everything else just completely falling. This feels empty. Let's see. Yep, so a little bit of empty packaging material. Hey, Bonda, you totally should have put on, like, a goofy little mug or something. Um, let's see. And we have the 3D paper craft display, which you kind of have to open up. Let's see if I can do this really quick here. Let's see, I got a... A little bit of cardboard and some bubble wrap. And... Just pull that out Whoop, really quick. And, oh, don't tell me there's assembly required for this. Oh, dear God, I think there's assembly required for this. Uh, well, okay, so maybe it pops out a bit. So maybe not too much assembly required. Let's set that aside. Um, all right, let's go for some of the books, since I think I'll be able to get this out without everything falling apart now. 
The art of Ninu Kuni. So you have some location and character art and stuff. Looks like a, a nice little coffee table book there. Uh, let's see if I can get this back in here real easily. Yeah, a little bit. And then we have the game itself. Collector's Edition in huge print. Includes Season Pass and the Special Sword Set, Exclusive Dragon's Tooth Sword. All kinds of fancy fun stuff. Um, and then we have the Steelbook case for it as well. Oh, that is nice and shiny. Which, ugh. Oh, there you go. Actually, has the Music Collection CD in it. And I do believe this is, yep, that's the making of disc. Cool. So let's just pop those guys back in here real quick. That should do. And I knew that was going to fall, so let me set this aside. As everything proceeds to fall down, and the Chibi Diorama set looks like this on the box, anyway. There's, there's really a lot of stuff in here, and this diorama by far seems to take up the most room, which is kind of what I was expecting looking at the back of the box. And let's see. Is this all reading material? Yes. Oh yeah, that's right, this thing is motorized. Like, it, it actually spins. Which is just crazy. I have no idea if batteries are included. I didn't actually read any of that, so uh, you guys can tell me if batteries are included. And... Some styrofoam... with more tape all around it. Let's see if we can take care of some of this tape here really quick. Boy, this is, this is packed uh, quite well. Like, I honestly don't know where to begin to try to open this thing. Because it is ridiculously well packed. I think the scary thing is, this is, this is better packed than some technology stuff that I've gotten recently. That, that's really a scary thought. Alright, this is the part where I'm going to have to destroy some of the styrofoam just to get it open. I mean, holy crap. Ugh, yep, this is not com coming open in a hurry. Sorry, I just bumped the camera there. Didn't mean to do that. But, uh, wow. You know what, I'm gonna cut, uh, cut this thing open and come back when I'm done cutting it open because this is gonna take a while. But not in the magic of editing, it won't. And the award for the most insane video game packaging that I have ever seen goes to Bondi Namco Entertainment. So, I finally got this thing open. Um, let's see. Oop. And... We had one of the characters fall off. So, uh... There's your three little... heroines there. And, uh... Here's a giant... Probably enemy, I don't know. Uh, there. There we go, now we're kind of focused. Uh, held in with more tape! Yay! And it looks like... Oh my god, there's even more little guys still. There you go. That looks very, like, Nausicaa-y. And let's see what we got here. Got a little... Another little... Guy with a helmet and a sword. Neato! Alright, well... Um, let's see if I can maybe take this thing out kind of quickly and give you a better look at it. This is surprisingly very plasticky, actually. 
<laughs> uh, and I think this is the off on switch. No batteries, I guess. Um, oh, it's, I guess, self winding. So, uh, you don't need batteries, you need physics. Maybe. Alright, maybe I gotta wind that more. Oh well. There you have it. That is, uh, Nino Kani to the Collector's Edition and all the, uh, insane amount of stuff it comes with. It's finally here, guys. For real. That'll be it.